Hey everybody, Joe here from Mainline Overland. We just wrapped up our next round of upgrades here on the MLO Bronco. Uh, this round we added the Prince of Roof Rack, the 40 inch Baja Designs Light Bar, as well as the new James Brood Odyssey Rooftop Tent. So let's dive in and take a closer look at everything that went into this install. There are quite a few roof rack options out there now for the uh, newer Broncos. Um, we decided to go with the Prince of Roof Rack. This was personally our favorite out of the entire selection out there. We really like this rack because of its low profile design. Um, it has a nice integrated cutout for the light bar up here. Uh, makes it super easy to mount uh, accessories like a rooftop tent. A really nice platform to build off of down the line. Um, they have tons of accessories to offer. Uh, so all those reasons are why we went with the Prinsu. Uh, this rack also has really good dynamic and static roof load ratings. Dynamic is rated for 600 pounds and static is rated for 1,000. Uh, which you look around out there and compare those to other, that's about the best um, that we've found on the market. So the install process on this Prince of Roof Rack isn't terribly difficult, but it is pretty complicated. This rack ships in a bunch of different pieces. Uh, there's these side rail panels, there's all the individual crossbars. It does take a bit of time to install, and it's definitely something we'd recommend bringing to a professional shop like us here at Mainline Overland. It does not require any drilling into your factory hardtop here. It utilizes these factory front accessory mounts, uh, which the factory roof rack from Ford um, uses this mounting setup up here. Um, so it's nice we don't have to worry about drilling into anything. And then moving down the back here, um, it's basically using a big clamp here. And this bracket is basically wedging itself under this uh, kind of built-in lip to the rack here. My favorite feature here on the Prince rack is the easy integration of a light bar. Uh, so when you order this rack, you can either order it with a light bar cutout or no cutout. Uh, we wanted to add a little bit more light to our build, so we opted to go for the version with the cutout. And this is made to fit a 40 inch Baja Designs light bar. Um, it may fit some other brands out there, but it's kind of designed to work around the Baja Designs version. Um, one note, if you are doing the uh, light bar install here, you will need to add the light bar brackets. It does not come with the um, roof rack kit. So I bet some of you out there are probably wondering why we went with a James Brood tent uh, for our Bronco. Uh, we went with James Brood because we've been working with them for a very long time here at MLO, and we think they make probably the nicest tent out there on the market. All the fit and finish, all the materials are super premium, and we've been super impressed, especially with the new Odyssey tent here. Uh, so that's what we went with. And we really like the kind of straight pop-up style versus the wedge, gives you a little bit more room inside, um, and I think it looks awesome on here. So our next task was getting the James Baroud tent mounted on top of this Prince rack. Um, it seems like a lot of other companies and shops out there are using either like a tent riser or they're stacking crossbars to kind of space this tent up a little bit uh, so it's easier to install. Uh, what we do here and we found this is definitely, it's not the easiest way to do it, but it does result in the cleanest install is we actually remove um, the two crossbars that we're gonna be mounting to the tent. And we basically mount the tent on those crossbars uh, with it off of the vehicle and then we get four or five guys to flip it over and mount the tent with the crossbars back onto the roof rack. So this allows us to get a super low profile mounting setup here. Um, it's gonna help with efficiency, reduce wind noise, um, stuff like that. So it's definitely not the easiest way to install this tent, but um, it's our preferred way here at the shop. As I mentioned earlier, this is James Brood's new Odyssey rooftop tent. We did a full walkthrough video not too long ago, uh, so we're gonna link that in the video here. You'll also find that link down in the description. If you're looking to learn more about this Prince Rack and our other Prince Rack offerings, go ahead and click the link below. That'll take us to our product page uh, for this rack. You can check out all of the other Prince products we have to offer. Uh, Prince makes really, really great products. Uh, we've been installing these for years. Uh, the powder coat finishing holds up really well. Uh, they're super popular on Toyota's nice low profile finish, uh, but kind of gives you tons of room up there to install tent and other accessories. Uh, so be sure to check those out down below.